Hello friends! Today you'll see how actors of the movie The Fifth Element have changed. You'll know the original names and age. I will show you how they looked then in 1997 and what's with them now in 2021. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. Let's go! Zorg owns many businesses, making him a very influential person. He always keeps collected and arrogant, doesn't know what pit he is and will spare no one in order to achieve his own goals and desires. Zorg handles firearms and bombs well. He was played by Gary Oldman. Ruby Rose is a popular radio host who is known for his unusual extravagant style and special show handling. He is adored by many listeners and is very popular with girls. In stressful and dangerous situations, he can behave like a shy girl. He was played by Chris Tucker. Cornelius Ian Holm is a priest who is an ally of the Mondo Chavans. For the sake of saving the world, he is ready to resort to cooler methods of influence. If necessary, he can use a weapon and be the person because the salvation of humanity is above all for him. Diva has a truly extraordinary operatic voice and unusual appearance. She enjoys absolute trust among the Mondashevans and has therefore been chosen for the important mission of transferring the Lilu Elemental Stones. The role was performed by Maywen Lebesco. Billy, played by Luke Perry, was involved in archaeological excavations in the early 20th century as an assistant to Pakali and didn't really believe in the existence of the great evil. He knows how to draw well and is good-natured, but can use weapons for protection. Human Aknot, like his other relatives, is a warrior by nature. He tries to keep outward calm and he also has leadership qualities which allows him to lead the Mangalore. It can take on a human form, but the voice remains the same. He was played by Vladimir McCrary. The check-in attendant checks passenger data before boarding the space shuttle. She is accustomed to clearly doing her job and in the event of an unforeseen or dangerous situation, she knows the protocol of actions. She is pretty sweet and welcoming, played by Sophia Goff. David is trained by Cornelius and tries to follow all his instructions unquestioningly, although he does not always want to. He is far from a fight, often shows cowardice, and therefore it is easier for him to escape from the conflict, played by Charlie Creed Miles. Mugger, Matthew Kosowitz. A frustrated robber who uses a weapon but does not even know how it turns on. He is characterized by not too high intelligence and the manifestation of fearfulness. If something doesn't go according to plan, he may react strangely and even dance. Corbin Dallas is a taxi driver who served in the government's special squad before retirement. He doesn't really like getting up in the morning and often breaks the rules. He got used to going to the end and fearlessness is characteristic of him, played by Bruce Willis. Toad Dry Girl is one of the Mangalore mercenaries who was tasked with infiltrating a spaceship to steal stones and defend the honor of their race. For this mission, he took the image of a woman, the wife of Carbon Dallas. The role was played by actress Eva Selway. General Monroe works for the Federation, reports regularly to the President and makes sound recommendations. He is the same person who is difficult to surprise, but the miracles of genetic engineering were able to stun him. The role was performed by Brian James. President Lindbergh is the head of state characterized by composure and severity. If there is a danger to the planet, he carefully monitors the operation. His every minute is scheduled, so he doesn't like being detained. The role was performed by Tom Lister Jr. Whip Stewardess is one of the space shuttle's flight attendants. She wears a distinctive, rather open, purple uniform with matching makeup. This stewardess is a very sensual person who could not resist Robbie's spectacular appearance and fainted. Played by Indra Owi. 
The right arm works for Zark and follows him almost everywhere. He is distinguished by his diligence and cunning disposition. Right arm follows any order from the boss and is afraid to make a mistake and disappoint him. They are always performed by Tricky. General Standard served in the Federation Army, likes to speak clearly and to the point, and he is also stubborn. His main principle is to shoot and not ask unnecessary questions. Killed during the operation to eliminate the enemy planet, he was played by John Neville. Mecklenburg, Christopher Fairbank, worked in the government laboratory, has good intelligence and is well versed in genetic engineering. Like many other scientists, he is crazy about his work and is overtaken by delight when he was able to revive a higher creation. General Tudor is an active member of the United Territories and the captain of the warship. He is responsible and executive. He was ordered to monitor the movement of the enemy planet and report any changes to the president. The role was performed by Al Matthews. Fogg is one of those who managed to survive after the Mangalore attack. At Floston Paradise, he held a non-executive position and was an ordinary officer by virtue of his age. After the attack, he became the main one, which he was not very happy about it, played by Lee Evans. Priest was part of a special community dedicated to keeping the five elements secret. With its help, inevitable knowledge was transmitted for 300 years, with the help of which it was possible to repel the attack of the great evil at the right time. Played by John Bennett. Chief New York cop Sam Douglas is a rather large man who, when performing, wears a special protective uniform. He is accustomed to reacting quickly to danger and making the necessary decisions no less quickly and he adheres to the maximum calmness when performing operations. President's aide, Sanita Henry, is always nearby in order to fulfill his assignment in the shortest possible time. She also informs the head of state about all important points. The assistant adheres to external equanimity and dresses strictly to match the president. Professor Pakili is outwardly a benevolent man in his 50s. He sincerely rejoices at new discoveries and dreams of becoming famous, and with new discoveries he experiences true joy. He worked in tandem with his assistant Billy. The role was performed by John Blithel. Major Iceborne, Julie T. Wallace works for the government and is under the command of General Monroe. She's a very large woman with an army bearing, keeps external equanimity, and her face rarely expresses any emotions. She is ready to fulfill any mission entrusted to her. Monroe's captain reports to General Monroe and serves in the Federation forces. Often accompanies the general, keeping himself confidently and coldly. He's physically fit and has a good bearing. The role of Monroe Captain is played by actor Hong Ping Tang. Neighbor is a humanoid race that can take the form of a human. He is not restrained enough and is inclined to show aggressiveness, disrespect, and also make threats towards the guards of law and order. He prefers to shave with a knife. He was played by Richard Leaf. Baby Ray is one of the passengers on the Flossman Paradise, which is known to the general public and enjoys considerable popularity. He can often be seen on television and also has a feature, almost complete deafness. The role was performed by actor Ian Beckett. Lilu Milejovic is one of the five elements that should help in the fight against evil. She is considered perfection, knows how to learn quickly, and is interested in learning about everything. Lilu has excellent combat skills and is capable of showing compassion. With Curtis, who took Carbon Dallas to Ruby Rock for an interview, she is friendly with passengers, shows goodwill, and tries to listen to the requests of the shuttle passengers. Whip Stewart is also a fan of the Ruby show. She was supported by Stacy McKenzie.
Thank you for watching. If you like this video, please share it on social networks, like it, and of course, subscribe to the channel.